Today we are making chocolate chip oatmeal cookies. And we're going to start off today with uh, two and a half cups of flour. I'm making a double batch, by the way, because it is Christmas time. And my family just loves cookies. So there's my two and a half cups of cookies. And then uh, we're going to have one tablespoon of baking powder. One tablespoon of baking soda. One tablespoon of cinnamon. And we use sea salt. And we're going to use half a teaspoon of sea salt. So then you take all the ingredients and you mix dry ingredients together. So they're nice and blended. I want to make sure the cinnamon is all kind of spread out so you can see it all throughout the batter. It comes like a brownish color. Then usually by then I know it's mixed enough and we're good. Okay, so then we set this dry mixture aside and then we start the fun stuff. Alright, step number two. Okay, now for the next step we're going to take uh, one and a half cups of butter. We're going to take two-thirds of a cup of sugar, granulated sugar, and one and a half cups of either brown or golden sugar, whichever you prefer. And you can use regular vanilla, but I like dark vanilla for my baking. And you mix them all up. You can use either a blender or mix by hand like I prefer to do. So we're just going to put them all into here and mix them together, okay? Okay, so we have the butter in the bottom. Sugar, golden sugar, which I'm using, and for this one we're going to use three teaspoons of the dark vanilla. Here's the batter when it's all like mixed together. And then we're going to take and add two eggs to it.
time. So, just taking half of the dry mixture and slowly mixing it in. take out my cookie sheets and my coloring racks. So away we go. Uh, the recipe calls for 375 TOI for me. So I'm going to set the oven for 350. <gasps> Why well, you know Sparky? You going to help mommy cook? <gasps> Come on. Oh, and Sparky's going to help him too. Wondering why I have three cookie sheets. This is why. One is cooling, 
ones in the oven and I just did the third batch here. So while this was cooling, I did another rack up. Now I'm going to take these rack of cookies and put them on the entrance. Alrighty, come on. <laughs> he just wants to sample the cookies. Okay, all the cookies. <laughs> oh, I love you too. Are finally cooked in all the cooling rack. And there's about seven dozen cookies total. Ooh, and you sampled one with Daddy, didn't you? Yes, you did. <laughs> Anyways, it's Susan saying uh, goodbye. It's been a pleasure baking with you today with the uh, milk chocolate. Ooh, oatmeal cookies. Mm -hmm. Are they good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, they were. Anyways, uh, from Susan, we're saying goodbye from Susan Frank's Cooking and Baking uh, channels. Uh, please subscribe. Thank you. Bye.